Hi right, guys, this is Dennis LG, um coming with a vlog from Moscow, Russia while well, I'm still here. Um, it's Tuesday, January the 2nd and I just, just wanted to show you the bears I've got so far. Some of these may end up uh, coming along with me to Canada, all others I'll probably drink here. First one is Triple Carmelite. I've already reviewed this and I got this from my uncle as a US gift. He, he really liked it and he tried it recently so he gave both me and my dad one bottle each. That's, that's a nice beer but I'll probably drink it here because I've already reviewed it. Um, then I got this nice Spitfire um, gift set, which I'm prob I'll probably leave the tube here. It's a sort of a cardboard box. I'll probably even maybe toss it. But it comes with a nice officially stamped uh, pint glass, which is a bit of a rarity now, because um, in England I think they're switching to the European system with the CE symbol. And a bottle of Spitfire, which I've also already reviewed, but I'm drinking here from the glass, it's still a nice bitter. Then um, this is Baltica number no. 6, very familiar to me, it's one of my favorite beers from Russia. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it, it depends how much time and you know desire I have. Um, these three I got at a specialized, specialized beer store in Moscow. It's a small shop actually, it's not a real big you know place. Um, the prices have gone up, which kind of upset me, but I still managed to get some interesting beers. This is from the Adnams Brewery. Uh, I don't know if you remember my broadside video, but this is another beer from the same English brewery, craft brewery. It's called Innovation, and it's sort of a, I'm not sure, it's a, it says a strong amber pale ale. Um, considerably, it says something about the hoppiness, which kind of interested me. So I'll see what that brings us. I'll definitely bring that back to Canada. I'm not sure but this one. It's the St. Peter's Cream Stout. If you saw my video with my friend Boris the Barbarian um, kind of bash another St. Peter's offering. So I decided to pick something more, you know, attractive and give that a try. Because I've heard it's a good brewery so it shouldn't be bad. Um, the bottle design has changed which kind of upset me as well now it's not a flask kind of shape it's it's you know it's more typical but it's very heavy and the last one I got from that shop was the La Trappe or La Trappe triple it's the, the only Trappist brewery not in Belgium right now it's the Dutch counterpart and should be a nice triple as well and the final bit interesting one um, I've already had a bottle like that but um, I liked it, so I'm going to review this sometime. Maybe it'll be a brief review from here. It's called Old Bobby Ale, but this is actually brewed by Baltica. It's the sort of venture into ales. I know they brew a port and everything, but this is their attempt at an English style bitter. It's a very weird design and promotion and everything, but it's only like a buck and a half um, if you convert it to dollars. Um, and it's very, very decent, surprisingly, coming from a big macro brewery, 4.5% ABV, it actually has exactly, apparently, exactly one pint in the bottle, so this is not a half litre bottle, this is like fifth, uh, 5, 68 mils or something, I'm not sure, because it says in very fine, oh yeah, 5, 68 mil mils, and it really tastes pretty decent, it tastes like, a, you know, above average English bitter, not anything close to the best ones, but it's still a very nice drinkable beer and it's cheap and it's nice, you know, it's